the forecast. Get to the maps right now. This is a live look from our Storm Team Tower Cam in Gadsden. All right, I also picked another cool place to hang out. That's on the water. This is a live look from the Coosa River there, and temperatures across the map are warm. We've got mid to upper 80s, or excuse me, mid to upper 70s and some low 80s. We have 81 in Birmingham now, 79 in Gadsden, 78 in Asheville. And as we look at those overnight temperatures, we're going to be staying in the 70s through at least sunset tonight, and then those temperatures dipping into the 60s shortly after midnight. We'll actually hold in the 60s through early tomorrow morning. Those overnight lows a bit more mild and you'll notice because of some of those clouds moving in from the south. See those red arrows on the map? Well, that indicates winds out of the south. As we look at our satellite and radar, there is a cluster of showers down towards the coast. So if you're beach bound, you may encounter a few raindrops along the Alabama coast and the Florida panhandle there. Otherwise, sunny for your Saturday and only a couple of stray showers tomorrow. So those lows tonight, 59 in Coleman. We have low 60s in Birmingham, 63 in Tuscaloosa with 62 in Moundville. As we move into your Saturday, let's kind of break this down a little bit. It will be dry to start the day, sunshine to greet your weekend, but notice the afternoon, just a stray shower. Remember that percentage 30%? It refers to the amount of people impacted by the rain, not a pinpoint location. So there's about a one in three chance of an afternoon shower or storm. I wouldn't go canceling plans just yet. This is going to be something that could impact us later in the afternoon. You'll notice on our future cast, see those little drops of rain west of I-65. They dissipate quickly, but then look what happens Sunday morning. That line of showers begins to move in, and my hope is that most of that rain falls in the morning hours. Our in-house model right now showing most of that wet weather is going to occur between sunrise and lunchtime on Sunday, meaning that we'll dry out as we move into afternoon. Race kicks off at around 2 o'clock, and that good news. So let's talk about Saturday though. Lots going on. Stallions game. Temperature should be in the 80s. Again, could be a hit and a shower around Birmingham. Might want to grab the poncho just in case. And then Sunday for the Grand Prix. Temperatures in the low 80s at their warmest. Stray shower possible. But I hear they just changed the wheels in case there's wet weather. And that seven day forecast showing that unsettled weather pattern though sticking around through the whole, the, the entire part of next week as well. And that is a look at your storm team seven day forecast. Back to you. All right, Ashley, thank you. We'll still